What's going on YouTube? It's your boy OGT Man, and today we got hold up camera difficulties. Bear with me. And today we got traffic stop turns into mag massive drug bust. Mm. Let's go ahead and see what this is about. Make sure you like, come subscribe. Let's get to the video. Don't worry about it. In the fall of October 2023, the DEA began an investigation after being tipped off through a confidential source. The tip alleged that a woman named Latasha Weatherspoon was repeatedly flying from California to Indiana in an effort to transport large amounts of crystal meth through commercial airline flights. However, Latasha's luck ended when undercover DEA agents observed her and two other women picking up suitcases and getting into a rental car from the airport. Here's what happened next. Morning, ma'am. How you doing? Not too bad. Special license registration with it's okay. Uh, just uh, anything with a ban or whatever. Why is it always black people? Why? My people. Why? Why do we keep incriminating ourselves? Uh, and it's too bad, bitty. You ever told a bit I got G and stuff. But wow, that's crazy. I should have known when they said Latasha Weatherspoon that this was going to be some shit. Are you in a hurry this morning? Somewhere. Yeah, we're going to a funeral. Oh, to a funeral? Yeah. Okay. Uh, that might work. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. It's all right. Um, back at, I believe it's Bridgeport. Uh, when you come on to Washington Street, um, you roll through the stop sign and come to a complete stop. Um, you're, I'll try to get you. You're good. Um, give me just a second. Let me run everything. Hey! Damn. Large drug bus. How are we doing today? Thanks for a second. Were y'all headed to? Yeah. A funeral? Yeah, we just landed and we don't know where we're at. We're supposed to take them to the gas station. Where y'all coming from? What? I, I get that. <laughs> well, what state? Uh, California is my cousin. Okay, alright. How long y'all staying? Y'all got a ton of luggage. A week. Yes. A week? Okay. Well, I'm staying here. They're staying here. Yeah. Okay, hang tight. Uh, <laughs> they done got the dog, though. Motherfucker's gonna get arrested. Yep. Uh. Man, is this window rolled up? I don't know. You got one back here, too. Go ahead, step out of the car for me. What am I step out of the car for, sir? Dog indicated. Go ahead, step out of the car for me. Okay, what? Step out of the car for me. Step out of the car. Just keep your hands right to see him. You can leave everything in the car. Turn around, face that way. Put your hands on your back. I'll explain everything here in just a second. You're not under arrest at this time. Okay. Go ahead and step out of the vehicle for what's me. Please, 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 go, go ahead and put your phones in there for me. For me. Before, but I don't know what's going on. So, out. all right, I got a narcotic dog, and he alerted that there's presence okay, of odor. Just put your phones down. Can I, can I record whatever it is? Yeah, you can record whatever you want. You can put it on record, but yeah, I actually not, just leave it there. On, you ain't got yeah. no weapons on you, nothing no, like that? Okay. All right, just turn around for me real quick. You're not under arrest. Yeah. You're not under arrest. You're just being detained, okay? She's making it. Because our, my dog alerted on the vehicle that there's a presence of narcotics. Yeah, you did. All right, step on back here for me. I'm going to put you next to this car because it's warm, okay? You just put your hands on the hood and keep your hands on that's it. I'm going inside. Step back here. Yep. Just put it right there. There's a little bit of heat come out of there because it is cold out. I'm going to have you step out, okay? You ain't got no guns, nothing like that? No, sir. Okay, go ahead and step out for me. Cuffs? Yeah, I'd use my second. You got your second? No, I don't. Where am I being uh, You're just being detained. You're not under arrest, okay? Uh, my dog alerted on the vehicle that there's a presence of narcotics. Uh, so we're going to search your vehicle. If there's nothing in there, then y'all are free to go. 
Yeah, in Indiana, if a police dog alerts on a vehicle, that's probable cause to search vehicle. Is there anything in the vehicle that shouldn't be in there? Uh, read them, Miranda, first. Are we going to find anything illegal in the, in the bags? Not that you know of? No, I only have a carry-on. You only have a carry-on? Yes. So my dog, he is trained on six odors of narcotics, cocaine, crack, heroin, ecstasy, meth, and marijuana. Yeah, yeah, come on. With this being a rental car, fairly new, I'm assuming there's no odor in the vehicle other than what you all brought into it. Uh, I don't know. You don't know? Can I talk to you real quick? Can you like... Um, you guys coming from? They're yeah, coming from LA. Uh, one is from LA. I think she's from Ohio. Uh, we just going to Kentucky for a How do you know them? That's my cousin, and that's the person that died. That's the girlfriend. That's one girlfriend. Person that died. Okay. Are you in relation to the girl up there? That's the girlfriend. Oh, yeah. Are you? Going to a are you related to that person up there? My cousin. No. Okay. When's when's the funeral? Huh? When's the funeral? It's today. Oh, today. Okay. Can you talk to me again? How do you know the other two? We're family. We're like really close friends. Okay. Mm -hmm. who, who was it that passed away? Our cousin. We call him our cousin. Oh, okay. How do you know her up there? Cousin. Cousin. Okay. When's, when's it, right? In two days. In two days? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So you got time. So we're not delaying you too long. Well, I just don't want you guys to be late or anything. Read. I smell it. I can smell it now. Here, grab, yeah. grab it. Hold on. Pull. No. Mm -hmm. oh, something just dropped. Tamp. Y'all seen that motherfucking package, nigga? It's over with. It's over with. But damn, that's crazy. Somebody had alerted them that they've been um going back and forth from California to Indiana to oh with large luggage. Oh, we that's some right ass. But I I would be concerned too. These these motherfuckers kept coming back and forth. I'd be concerned too. That's heavy though. I don't know if that's weird or not. Can't all be weird. That's crystal. Yep. Oh boy. That's a bunch of crystal. You said what? So we're good on this bag. I got everything there. What'd you get? Um. Right after I do the oh, video, heavy. I was going to go work out, but. That one came out of that. Let me get a picture of that one came out of there. So just let me go again. Mm -hmm. I'll help whenever, um, whenever I'm done. All right. But so here's, here's the deal. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you I see, but they're getting bundles of narcotics out of bags, okay? I talked to other people, and they claim the other bags aren't theirs, okay? Here's the thing. I understand sometimes people, they get into a money situation where, hey, they, need, they get down on luck or whatever, so they feel like they need to do something. That doesn't mean somebody's a bad person. I just wonder what your story is. My story is... My father is in law enforcement. Um, I grew up buried in a sheltered community. So what happened today? Today, um, just with my cousins going to a funeral. Okay, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop you right there, okay? The funeral story is BS because I talked to everybody in the video, okay? Nothing matches up, all right? So we can start over. What's going on today? Because you know and I know that's not true, okay? So how did you end up here with a bunch of narcotics? I just came um, with my cousins. You came with your cousins? So where's the narcotics going? Because that's what I'm concerned about now. I have no idea. Okay. So how did you end up here? Are you getting paid to bring this? Um, you get a little bit, I'm sure. I literally don't know what else is going on. Are you getting paid or anything? Like, or? Um, no. Because they're claiming all these bags are yours. Um, okay. Damn. Why they? Why they throw on it? Nah, that's fucked up. They claiming all them bags hers. That's crazy. Mm mm mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's get right. to the, my bad, y'all. 
I think he gave a good pitch. Yeah. Mm. You know, starting a business is hard. Y'all yeah, see all that shit? Jesus. No question. Yes, ma'am. Does that affect everybody? You said what now? They, the guy just told me that that is crystal meth in her luggage, right? There was crystal meth in every one of the suitcases. Yeah, but the guy, none of that is not. Yeah, they told them I have all orange bags. Does that affect me? Be honest no. with you, I don't know. It's gonna be up to the I'm courts. I'm a parent. Yeah, I don't, I don't do that. Wait, so I'm being arrested? I don't know if you're being arrested. Or oh, yeah, not. I'm like, I don't have. It. They just went through all my stuff. I don't. Were any of the big bags, um, the girl that's up in the front? What's her name? Uh, Aunt Christine Enriquez. Christine Enriquez. Marlene Richardson. Yeah, all of the bags are tagged to all of us so that she can get free stuff. It's hers in there. She can only take two bags free and she's stamping two. Okay, I gotcha. The only thing mine is orange luggage. I told you guys that when you first put us over. Okay, so this one is hers. They're all hers. Her clothes. Look at this one. Well, this one's, this one's tagged uh, yeah, Marlene Richardson. Yeah, because free. She needed to check extra stuff. She's staying two bags of peace so we let her check. But the only thing that's mine is that and my fashion over outfits are orange stuff. Okay. I don't have anything with me. I don't do whatever that is they do. I don't mind. What name's that one? Everybody's saying this prep's not theirs. Okay, that's fine. So they they can because she's trying to say yeah that's that's her name, but she was using it for free luggage or whatever. Problem is your name's on it. So and also for free luggage, then the dopes and the luggage. Right. So we know which bags the dopes came out of. Yep. Right? Yep. Okay. I got I got each ID with phones, whose is whose. Plus it's on camera, so each person had dope in their bags. They they all had their name and had dope in them, right? Yep. Percent sure. Name, name, name. And different names. Name. Different yep. names, all of them, right? Yep. So yep. all of them have a bag with their dope in it. Yeah. They all said that they're going to a funeral. I wouldn't want to in the day of the funeral, they all gave me different dates. She said tomorrow, uh, one of them said tomorrow, I have to double look the camera. One of them said two days, and one of them said today. And then the other one's like, well, the wake's today. Um, okay. One of them identified all themselves as cousins. I just said their stories were inconsistent. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she, the driver mm -hmm. told me that they were cousins of two of them front, said, and now they're friends, right? Yeah, I don't do this. I'm a public figure. I have two million followers on Instagram. She been talking to that man for 30 minutes. I know police. When a police officer like take the liking to one person and keep talking, it's because that's the one that's gonna talk. Oh. I was trying to get the bald head dude attention. Uh, that dude on the right. Yeah. Um. What I'm gonna say, I can't stay on a fucking body cam. You wanna talk to him again? Hey, your body cam is gonna get. I can't. I can't have this on record. Let me. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll bring him back. Hold on. Them people who start with a C, you in between the lines? The people who start with a C? Okay. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, give me a second. Thank you. No problem. Hi. I just said you want to talk real fast. Yep. Well, I didn't want to talk to them because they have body cam and my safety matters. Right. Um, Now's your shot. So, if I told you that there were more people coming to them with way more sh what happens? That's good. Anything you can tell me would be cooperative. If you knew where they were taking it, that would be no, good. No, I don't. But I know that she has previous dealings with people who start with a C from Mexico. Okay. And she know. being Tasha. Yeah. So she has ties to the cartel. Tasha, Tasha or does. Tasha does. Tasha does. If somebody can talk to me, yeah, I can give them that and I know who else they was meeting. I know who else was coming. Niggas be folding under pressure, but I ain't gonna lie. I do the same thing. What I'm going to jail for? I just want some money on. And if that means I can keep my my freedom in exchange for going to get some money on. Or getting some money on out of snitching? Oh, best believe I am. I'm gonna be <laughs> whistling like a mup, like a cussing and whistling like a sailor boy. Jail is not meant for me. Dropping me off and going to meet these people. I was going to my Airbnb. I can give you all of that. Will I be home by Christmas? Where's Where it coming tomorrow? SDF. Okay, Louisville. Is that that's SDF, correct? Yep. Okay. Do you know who's bringing it? Yep. Okay, let me get on the phone. Hold on. I'm Sean. Hi, Sean. How are you? My name's David. It's Dave. Hi, Dave. I'll get you. Sean, Dave, law enforcement. You got 100 pounds of crystal methamphetamine and bags. There's three of you guys. State police called us here. So how did the bags get in your car? You're the, I don't know what's in there. You were the driver of the yeah, car. Yeah, I don't know what's in their bags. You don't know what's... So mm -hmm. those bags are not yours or theirs. They're theirs. You had no idea. I hadn't had no idea I was driving with that in my car. I don't see who's who's. Your... I don't know. I don't, I don't, it's nothing, not mine. But, okay. It has nothing to do with me. Nothing so, you yeah, didn't so, see anything, you don't know anything. Well, okay, we're gonna move to the next uh, car. Okay. All right. All right. Thanks. You're welcome.
Right. The substances later tested positive for crystal meth and weighed over 112 pounds. Yeah, Latasha geez. Weatherspoon, Marlene Richardson, and Christina Enriquez were then all charged with a felony count of dealing meth weighing 10 or more grams. Delta Airline passenger flight records showed that Weatherspoon has transported drugs through the Indiana airport at least seven times in 2023. Christina also confessed that Weatherspoon paid her between $1,000 to $2,000 per trip, leading prosecutors to believe Latasha was the leader behind this scheme. Latasha and her crew face up to life in prison if they're convicted. Oh, that's tough. Couldn't be me. I couldn't be my life in prison. Life in prison. But anyways, that's the end of the video. Make sure y'all like this shit at 1.9, almost 2 million views, 10 to 8. TSA misses 112 pounds of meth, but pull me out of line for having shampoo in my bag. <laughs> TSA be on that bull. She snitched so fast, she was telling on people who even arrived yet. I'm saying... When that when they get to telling time, can you imagine the way their hearts hit the floor seeing it was light flash after thinking they were in the clear after making it through the airport? Boy, I don't want to talk to them because they have body cameras while being recorded in fork. Nah, that is some funny stuff. She need no. But anyways, that's the end of the video. Make sure I like, come subscribe, your boy OGT Man. Signing out. Yeah, dude.